from bells that jingle to lights that twinkle. If you ever wondered what Christmas time in a mythical, magical winter wonderland would be like, then let us show you one. This is Christmas in Vienna. Full Pension, located in Vienna's fourth district, is a cafe and social initiative that helps bring awareness to the issues surrounding elderly poverty. They do this by providing a space where people of all ages can come and learn how to bake from or alongside older members of the community. The holidays for some can be a season of loneliness, especially for the elderly, which is why a place like Full Pension is necessary and comforting during these times. Welcome in our cafe Full Pension. Thank you. Here is the best coffee and also the best cake named Sachertorte. It's become an intergenerational meetup spot where you can stop by, grab something tasty to eat, and find yourself in conversation with a new friend. It's also a great place to partake in one of the greatest Christmas traditions of all, cookie baking. We all need an excuse to go outside when the weather gets cold. And Vienna's Christmas markets give everyone a happy reason to do just that. They've become the stuff of international holiday legend, and there are more than we could possibly ever count, which is why we decided to pick out a few of our favorites. Have you ever fancied having Christmas cookies and mulled wine outside of a beautifully lit palace with gardens and a view? If so, then Schloss Belvedere's Christmas Village will serve you that exact experience. And although it's located in the center of the city, it still remains one of the less busy markets, which makes it perfect for couples or anyone wanting to simply and quietly enjoy the atmosphere. Imagine wanting to push the boundaries of electrical science, but instead, along the way, you end up creating one of the most enduring, recognizable, and curious Christmas charms of all time. Such was the story of Erwin Perzi, a medical technician turned emperor-approved toy maker who gifted the world with a moment of wintry magic suspended in a glass ball. At the original Wiener Schneekugel Manufaktur, the workshop still hums with authentic handcrafted labor, and here you can visit not only the original atelier, but a small museum as well. It's just one of the many interesting and offbeat museums that Vienna has to offer. The Wiener Schneekugel Manufaktur is just another example of local artists who also sell their crafts during the holiday season at one of the Christmas markets. Dankeschön. A visit to Vienna during Christmas time doesn't have to begin and end with only one market. If you're willing to travel even a small distance, there are lots of squares and parks that have taken up the Christmas market tradition. And almost all of them are easily reachable with public transportation. Some legends claim that the Christmas markets began in Vienna during the Middle Ages. While that's been disproven, the oldest credibly recorded market in the city started here, at Freyung, 250 years ago. And it remains popular, not only because of its beautiful cobblestone setting, which hosts Austria's largest nativity scene, but also because of the food. It can feel like row after row of the best cheeses, the best meats, and the best cakes that you have never tried before in your life, and you may never again anywhere outside of here. And because we all know that every good meal needs a tasty beverage by its side, we come to a Christmas season highlight, hot mold drinks. Different types of punch and glühwein are a staple. And each market serves them in their own unique mug. And if you're like me, you may feel the urge from time to time to push pause on the urban bustle and instead experience the romance and the spirit of Christmas time in an atmosphere of natural beauty. Twilkenschanz Park is one of Vienna's many green areas located outside of the city center that is easy and close to get to but can make you feel as though you've been transported far away. It's a jewel of a park tucked in the 18th district with enough trees, hills, and hidden paths to make you almost believe that you'd somehow wandered into a distant village. And I got a tip for you. 
go into the Ivy app, go into the walks and guides option, and here you're gonna find a Christmas market guide that you can follow on your next trip to Vienna. One is never too old or too young to be transfixed by a dazzling display of Christmas lights, which is probably why for a few weeks every year, Vienna is painted in electric magic, from the trees and parks to its busiest streets and most famous buildings. A yearly highlight are the lights along Vienna's Ringstrasse, the Graben, Rotenturmstrasse, Anagasse, and many more. Ah, what would Christmas time be without falling recklessly on ice underneath twinkling lights? The Wiener Eislaufverein has made its yearly reappearance in the same spot in the center of the city since the year 1867. Its longevity is a testament to just how much the Viennese love to ice skate during the winter. It's become another treasured community tradition that transcends every age and remains inexpensive and fun, even if you aren't a pro on the ice, like me. <laughs> the city lets you skate on rooftops, in parks, and in seasonal pop-up spaces like this. If you come to the city for the holidays and you want as authentic of a Viennese Christmas experience as possible, I suggest you do one of the following. Strap on some skates, grab a glue vine or a punch, or settle into a cozy winter walk through a market or a lit up street. But above all else, Christmas is about feeling connected to one another and it's about reflecting on all the things that we hold most dear. If you like what you see and you want to see more, you can go to our channel, hit subscribe. And until next time, I'm Medea, Frohe Weihnachten, Merry Christmas, and Servus, love from Vienna.